Sometimes I really receive crazy comments. Very, very demonic comments. And I know some people say that it is very harsh of God to send people to hell. But I'm telling you, when you begin to pray for people, when you begin to teach other people about God and put yourself out there to minister to people, you are going to find out why God sends people to hell. It is not because people are ignorant, per se. It is because people are wicked. Let's look at a comment that I received. And I am not saying anything bad about this person. I am not saying that this person is going to hell or anything like that. I just want you to share or I want to share with you some of the outrageous comments that I receive. Okay. So let's read this first one. Okay. The Bible does not actually say anything about fornication. Are you serious? That is one of the many mistranslations the Greek Bible say pornea, which does not mean fornication. It means unnatural sex, sex act. God has no problem with you having sex. People are going to hell. It is not because of ignorance. I can read this and see that this person does not believe in what they are saying. I can easily discern that this person knows what the Bible is saying, but chooses to believe or say, I guess I can say, things that are not true. This person knows that fornication is a sin, but they are trying to push out God's rules out of their mind so they can continue doing it, believing that they are not doing wrong. If someone told me, if I made a video and said, Santa Claus is real, how many people would contact me and tell me that Santa Claus is not real? Not too many people or any at all. At the most, many people would laugh or feel sorry for me, like, hey, this person does not know any better. But when people contact me and say that something is wrong when it is obvious that what I am saying is right, that tells me they are convicted about the material that I brought out. If you have seen any of my videos, even people that don't know much about God knows that fornication is wrong. This is why people go to hell. And I am not saying that this person is a bad person. I am not saying anything bad about this person. But what I am saying, people know the truth about God's word, but they choose to do evil when they know what is right. It is not about ignorance. So I pray that this makes sense. This is why we have to continue to teach other people about the Bible. Because if this person does not repent, if anyone does not repent 
Those people will go to hell. I can tell that this person is forcing him or herself to believe a lie which they don't believe. They are just saying it. And guess what I do with comments like this? I don't respond to them. What I do, I go right here. Boom. <laughs> Comment removed. So I pray that this makes sense. God bless.